Hello everyone, welcome to Study to Light. This is daily current affairs series and this series is relevant for aspirants of state PCS, lower PCS and IS prelims examination, SSC, banking, PSI, railway, UPSC, EPFO, CDS, Air Force and every other examinations. This series will cover your factual portions for every examination and after watching this series continuously, you can rest assured and be confident about your factual portion for the examination. Let's begin. Here is your question for the day. You have to answer this question in the comment section and next day we will see how many of you answered this question correctly in the comment section. Here is a question. Which state became the first state to start pool testing? What is pool testing? We have already discussed what is pool testing in last day video. So those who have not was that video was that and these are the options for this question read the option carefully and then answer and last day those who have answered the question correctly were Noor Sabha, Sai Ram, Akhila Akhi, Gopinath, Sradhasri, Krishnakant, Avinas, Siv Kumar, Kalyan Panuganti, Rasmita, Rivalin, Esar, Rekha, Chinta Sarmukhasari, Balaji Gopal, Manjunath Naikar, Neeraj, Satyanath Reddy, Busra Anjum, Rohit Chakravarti, Vishesh Kadam and others. So let's move ahead. And before we move ahead, don't forget to share these videos with your friends and your loved ones. Let everyone benefit out of it. So let's begin. The first question, Sahyo app has been developed by, so Sahyo app has been developed by Department of Science and Technology. So here A will be the right option. This mobile application and the website will be managed by Survey of India. This application will aid devising area specific strategies to handle the socio-economic impact. See the impacts has been differing in different parts of the country because of COVID-19 pandemic. So this will help to devise and formulate area specific strategies. Next, Kai Cord was established in so Kai Cord was established in 2008. So here A is the right answer. Kai Cord or Cyber Coordination Center help in dealing with cyber crimes. It operates under Ministry of Home Affairs. Remember, Kai Cord operates under Ministry of Home Affairs, and Kai Cord has been in news recently because it has red flagged Zoom application. It has issued a cautious notification for government officials that they should not use this Zoom application. What is this Zoom app? This Zoom app is a web-based video conferencing tool that allows users to meet through video and voices. Next question, National Sports Day is celebrated on. So National Sports Day is celebrated on August 29th. Here C will be the right option. This day mark the birth anniversary of legendary hockey player Dhyan Chand. So Dhyan Chand was born on 29th of August and on this day the Fit India movement was launched by Prime Minister Modi in 2019. Remember on this day Fit India movement was launched by Prime Minister Modi in the year of 2019. Why it was in news? Recently government of India has launched Fit India Active Day program under Fit India. Say Fit India was launched in 2019 and under this movement government has launched fit india active day program what does this aim this aims to make sure that children practice fitness even during lockdown and this fit india active day program has been launched in partnership with cbse remember this fit india active day program has been launched in partnership with cbse next question National Human Rights Commission that is NHRC in short was established in so National Human Rights Council was established in the year of 1993 this is very important this year NHRC has been in news continuously so you can expect one or two questions from NHRC so NHRC was founded in 1993 and NHRC was established on 12th of October 1993 see NHRC is a statutory body which means that it is established by passing a law by the parliament and this law was protection of 
Human Rights Act 1993 and remember that NHRC is a, a statutory body it is not a constitutional body it is not a constitutional body means to say that there are no articles referring to national human rights council in the constitution so it was created by passing a law by the parliament and it has a chairman and four members the chairman is a retired chief justice of in india so who is the present chairman of nhrc so the present chairman is justice h l dattu remember justice h l dattu is the present chairman of nhrc and this chairman and members hold office for a term of 5 years or until they attain 70 years so remember the date 12th of october 1993 next question john horton conway died of covid 19 recently was a so john horton conway was a mathematician so here c is the right answer and john cotton conway invented game of life what is game of life see under this game of life he stated that a cell can either live or remain alive or it will die it cannot remain in both state at the same time it has to be either in dead form or alive and whether it will remain alive or dead will depend on its neighbors so john horton conway was a very famous mathematician next question which is the first country to hold national election among covid 19 pandemic so it is south korea south korea has conducted national level election even during the covid 19 pandemic and in the election ruling democratic party of president moon jae won 180 seats so moon jae will most probably be again the president of south korea next question siachin day is commemorated on so siachin day is commemorated on 13th of april it marks the completion and the successful completion of operation meghdoot next question bcci was formed in so bcci was formed in the year of 1928 so here a will be the right option bcci stands for board of control for cricket in india i repeat board of control for cricket in india it is the national governing body for cricket in india it was formed as a society registered under tamil nadu societies registration act remember initially in 1928 it was formed as a society registered under tamil nadu societies registration act and the headquarters of bcci is in vankhede stadium which is in mumbai remember the headquarters is in vankhede stadium and the present president of bcci is saurav gangli the present vice president of bcci is mahim verma and present secretary is jaisa i repeat it present president is saurav gangli present vice president mahim verma present secretary jaisa you can remember by this secretary sa why news recently bcci has suspended ipl that is indian premier league 2020 indefinitely because of fear of covid-19 next question there are blanks kinds of contributions that make up funding for the who so there are four kinds of contributions that make up funding for who remember the number there are four kinds of contributions that make up the funding of who these are assessed contribution specified voluntary contributions core voluntary contributions and then pandemic influenza preparedness contributions what are these c assessed contributions are those contributions which member countries contribute to who to become member of who remember assessed contribution are those contribution which are given by the member countries like india us china japan and other countries to be member of who while a specified voluntary contribution under this voluntarily contribution is done by member countries or other bodies what is core voluntary contribution see these are the contributions which help to finance those activities which are lacking finances so it helps to complete those activities and pandemic influenza preparedness pandemic influenza preparedness started in 2011 it helps 
developing country to get access to vaccines and drugs to recent influenza viruses next question who is who's biggest contributor so it is united states of america united states of america provides around 14.67% of the total contribution of who and i have taken this in order usa is the largest contributor of who second largest contributor is bill and melinda gates foundation and third largest contribution to who is gavi vaccine alliance remember the top 3 usa bill and melinda gates foundation and then gavi vaccine alliance why it was in news recently usa has decided to stop funding to who usa accuses who of doing favor to china and putting the security of world at risk and united kingdom is the fourth largest contributor to who while germany is the fifth largest contributor to who while india provides 0.48% of the total contribution to who while china provides only 0.21% so you have to remember that india provides more funding than china to who india provides 0.48% while china provides only 0.21% while us is the largest contributor to who but but now since it has stopped funding to who it will not remain the largest contributor to who next question harpoon missile system has been originated in so harpoon missile system has been originated in united states of america so here a will be the right option and the harpoon was first deployed in 1977 and it is an all weather over the horizon anti ship missile system us will provide 10 agm 84l harpoon block to air launched missiles now let's see some more facts which were in news india has decided to buy 1 lakh rna extraction kits and 5.5 lakh antibody testing kits from china so remember india is buying 6.5 lakh testing kits from china and this antibody testing kits detects igm and igg antibodies see whenever our body comes in contact with any virus in this case sars cov 2 our body generates antibodies to fight against the virus so this antibody testing will detect igm and igg antibodies this will provide information that whether our body has generated antibodies to fight against those virus if yes then the result will be positive that the patient has been affected from covid 19 this will provide result only within 20 to 30 minutes so don't forget to share these videos like the video if you find it useful subscribe to the channel answer the question in the comment section wait for the upcoming video until then stay at your home and stay safe